I don't think it actually made me stronger as a woman until I got not not I wouldn't even say just a positive pregnancy test because even then I was still nervous until the second trimester where they're like, you know, okay, you're out of the red area where you have a, a very high success rate from this point on. It it kind of really breaks you. As a woman, you you feel like, you know, you're supposed to be a mom and a nurturer. And one of the great things to me about being a woman is being able to have children and, you know, create new life with, with your husband and things like that. And after the miscarriage, I felt like I couldn't do that. And the doctors actually told me that as well. Like, you know, there's no way that this could happen naturally. You're going to have to go through this process and that process. And not only is it re- really lengthy, lengthy, like my husband explained, but there's like so much medication that you're taking, expensive medication that thank God I was able to, you know, afford. And I feel sorry for the people that can't afford it. And um, there's months of injections in your stomach and blood drawing. It just It's just a lot. And you, you feel less than a woman. And you feel like, you know, inadequate. So when you get the positive pregnancy test, you want to be happy, but you you always have it, but like, what if something goes wrong? So when we first found out and he was just telling the whole world, even though I told him to wait because he was so excited, I was more so nervous because, you know, I just, I just didn't want to, I don't know, I guess jinx it or tell everybody. And then we have another upset like before. So I, I definitely think that I don't I don't think it ever makes you you know feel like a woman or any of those like great things if anything you you tend to doubt yourself a lot